Hello there, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we are making spaghetti, a simple recipe. I hope you like it. Um, and these are the veggies that we are going to use. I'm going to use peas, carrots, red onions. I'm also going to use French beans, capsicum, garlic, and for the spices, I'm just going to use curry powder and two two Royco beef cubes and tomato paste, of course, and the spaghetti. So I like to start off by boiling the spaghetti. I just put them in cold water and then bring, in, bring them to a boil. And I boil them for like 5 minutes until they are ready and I just set them aside. And now I start preparing the veggies and I'm just going to start off by frying the red onion. And after it starts turning brown on the sides, I now add the garlic, crushed garlic. And I give that a good stir. And just keep stirring because garlic tends to stick at the bottom of the pan. So keep stirring, especially if you are not using a non-stick pan. Then add tomato paste. I'm using that whole sachet. And then give it another mix. And guys, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, kindly consider subscribing. Please support my channel so it can grow. And then now at this point I like to, to add my spices and salt. I don't know about most of you but that's how I do it. So I added the beef cubes. I also added one tablespoon of curry powder. But you can add more or less spices of course depending on your preferences and what you like. Give that a good stir. And now after all that, now start adding the, the, the veggies and since I cut even the French beans to small sizes, means that I'm not going to cook them beforehand. I just added, added them together with the spices like that. Then give it a good mix, ensuring that all the veggies come together and that all the veggies are covered in spices. And then after that, cover the veggies and cook them for 3 to 5 minutes. The green peas were pre-boiled. And also if you got coriander at hand, you can add you can add it here. And after five minutes, you can see the veggies are ready. They are very well cooked. Now turn the flame to low. And now add the boiled spaghetti and then start mixing in. And guys, I think I need to get that thing for mixing spaghetti because I use my muiko and... <laughs> It takes a, a long time to bring all the ingredients together, especially because I use my spaghetti when they are full. I don't cut them into pieces. But anyway, that's how the final outlook was. The spaghetti was delicious. I hope you try it out and I hope you like it. Thank you so much for those that have continued to support this channel. And I hope you have a nice week and I wish you all the best as you, try, you plan to try out this recipe.